How to make a non-alcoholic Miss Collins. Hello and welcome to Video Drug. We've come to Zeta Bar at the Park Lane Hilton in London. Head bartender Mauro Pisano is going to show us how to make a deliciously thick fruit fusion known as a non-alcoholic Miss Collins. Step 1. You will need 6 raspberries, 50 milliliters or approximately 2 fluid ounces of peach puree, ice cubes, and some guava juice. Here's that list again. You'll also need the following utensils. A cocktail shaker. Marrow uses a Boston shaker, which is a metallic shaker with a mixing glass that also acts as a lid, but any cocktail shaker will do. You'll also need a tall glass and a cocktail stick. To measure out the ingredients, Marrow is going to use a standard double shot measure, which is equivalent to 50 milliliters, or approximately two fluid ounces. If you don't have one of these, you could use a measuring jug or measuring spoons instead. Mara will also use a standard bar spoon, which is equivalent to an ordinary teaspoon. Step 2. Raspberries. Put three or four raspberries into the mixing glass. Step 3. Muddle. Muddling is a cocktail term for crushing fresh ingredients like fruit and herbs to release their flavour. Use the flat part of a spoon to muddle the raspberries until they are pureed. Step 4. Peach Puree. Add 50 milliliters or 2 fluid ounces of peach puree. Step 5. Ice. Now fill up the rest of the mixing glass with ice cubes. Step 6. Top up with guava juice. Step 7. Shake. The Miss Collins needs to be shaken hard. Put the top half of the cocktail shaker on, slap it down firmly to seal, hold the top and bottom, stand at an angle, and shake vigorously over your shoulder for about 20 seconds. Handy hint. When there is condensation on the outside of the shaker and it feels very cold, then it's mixed. Step 8. Release. Tap the side of the shaker to loosen the two halves. Release the top by rocking it back and forth. Step 9. Pour. Now pour everything into a cocktail glass. Step 10. Garnish. Place two raspberries onto a cocktail stick as a garnish. Add two straws and stir. And serve.